Good afternoon Lions fans, Bree Conan here. Uh, tonight on Locker Talk we're talking all about Survivor. Let's go see what the girls have to say. Ah Maria, come here! We've got the man of the moment, Survivor extraordinaire, Simon Black. How are you going? Hey Bree, how are you? Yeah, good. We're talking Survivor. Yeah, absolutely. Very good. Got some hard-hitting questions for you. Right, hit, hit <laughs> what food meal would you want as a reward? Steak, mushroom sauce, mashed potato. And no, even thought that. Salad. No, pub, pub, medium rare. Yeah. Medium rare. Medium okay. rare. A little bit overdone. Probably like some Chinese <laughs> cuisine. <laughs> That's a pretty broad reward. Yeah. Anything in in particular? Oh, Spring rolls. Nah, fried rice and like a stir fry, beef and black bean, Mongolian lamb. Uh, a burger. I would have paid a thousand, probably thousands of dollars for a burger out there. After Did you that. win any reward challenges? Yeah, heap. Won a heap. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so. No, but, but, um, fish and chip one at day 14 um, after rice and beans for 14 days. It was amazing. And then I had about 18 days of just um, rice and beans again at about day 37. Had a, I don't know, it was a burger or something. So, yeah, the burger was the best thing I've ever eaten in my life. Yeah. Just like a platter of donuts or like chocolate self-sourcing pudding. They're probably my two favourite. Alright, so nutrition is key priority here. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep, fair, good. How long do you think you'd last on Survivor? Look, I'd probably back myself. Like, I wouldn't be too strong. Confidence is key. No, I wouldn't be too strong in the challenges. So like, people wouldn't What do you mean? Why? Oh, because I'm not athletically, you know, strong. So people would like, <laughs> I, people wouldn't think I was a threat. So I'd just like be really good at the social game, I reckon. How long do you think you'd last on Survivor? <laughs> round two, we'll go round About two. About 42 days. <laughs> <laughs> just a random guess? Uh, yeah, no, I uh, I'd love, would love to have done it again, but. Um, I'd be, you should be on that All Stars. I uh, should have, would have, could have. Yeah, six words in six weeks. I wasn't going to get asked, was I? <laughs> <laughs> I reckon I'd make it to the middle. In the, in the middle. middle. Yeah. Yep. Smack bang. Smack bang in the middle, then just voted off. <laughs> I just try to win the games, but meant the mental part of it. What do you reckon your, your downfall would be? Uh just the mind games, like I wouldn't be able to I'm not I don't think I'm smart enough for it. Like, oh, I think I'm smart, I think I'm smart, no, but like not fell. enough not enough to challenge people. I don't know. I reckon I'd go pretty early. I'm not very good at lying. I'd give yeah, you too quick. It's probably <laughs> a key, isn't it? Yeah. Not even apply for the show. No, nah, no way. No. <laughs> Who do you reckon you would be the surprise underdog? Surprise underdog in the team. Talia. Talia, Talia Hickey. Why? Because everyone would be focused on everything else and then she'd just like, even though she's tall, she'd just slip, slip, slip. under and just win. Yourself? You backing yourself? Uh, um, no. Like in the team? Yeah. Um, well, Stakes would be, he wouldn't last a day, Stakes, he'd just be, Roger wouldn't be much better. Yep. He's mamby pamby at home too much. I'd have to say Stars. Stars, surprise yeah. underdog. I reckon he would be. I Play the social game? I reckon he'd be rat cunning, Stars. Oh yeah. Uh, maybe like Geordie. <laughs> I think because she's, like, she's quiet and but like, I don't know. Under the radar, yeah, sneaky. Sneaks under the radar. Too small, you don't even notice it. Yeah, a bit of a grey man, so she'd be alright. <laughs> yeah, myself. Myself. <laughs> I'm wow, not... all that thinking. Who's that person I, I, I look at in the mirror every morning? Yeah, me. Okay. Which two teammates would you want in your alliance though? Um, I'd go the army girls, Lugsy and Lutzy. Okay. Right. Why? Well, I just reckon like if it all went bad, they'd be pretty good at like all the field stuff as well. If we actually... <laughs> the challenges. <laughs> you just got to win the challenges. No lying, straight face. <laughs> yeah, well, I reckon they'd be all right. Lutzy. Okay, lutzy has been a popular vote. Why? Yeah. Just, I reckon, like... A beast in challenges. Beast, yep. I reckon she'd be pretty smart too. She'd keep a level head. Yeah. Yep. Keep me calm. And then I'm going to say Dax as well. Just like, just <laughs> two Daxie? different, completely two different. Because okay. then, you know, give you a bit yeah, of Dax will stir the pot a bit. Yeah, and I would she'd imagine. Also, she'd also take the attention off me, you know. So. <laughs> oh, smart. I like diversion. <laughs> yeah, yeah Gab, Gab's would be, she'd be good value on the really? beach. Okay. Uh, and you get knocked out pretty early with Gabs on you in your alliance. I though. reckon. I reckon big, <laughs> big Dax. Big, do you reckon Gabs is pretty? Yeah, I reckon you chose him. No, well, I don't know. I only got to 42 days last time. You'd be a snitch. <laughs> no, I reckon Dax would be good value on the beach. My Dax. I reckon she'd have some good stories. Yeah. Um, and she just you entertained. She'd keep you entertained. And I reckon the lack of food and sleep, she turned into a, a wild woman. I would want Lutzy. Why? Um, 
because Lutzi is just, she wins everything. <laughs> so she'd be really good at challenges. And then socially, I'd probably want Emily because she's really good at the social game as well and is really tactical. Okay. So probably those two. Yeah, that's a good choice. Thanks for being on Lock Talk, Abby. Thank you. Thank you for having me. <laughs>